In this lesson, we want to explain how to rotate and move and work with objects. In this scene, as you can see, by clicking on any object, we can select it, select them and handle. There is a handle to control them. That will be up here. Which is in the default, it has an arrow to move the object up and down, as you can see that you can move it if you want to do this precisely hold the mouse on all this handle and now is enough to type a number note that the default unit of the software is in the meters and the number one is one meter for example if you want to move the object 40 type 40 centimeter type 0 dot Four. This is forty centimeters. The other, the other handle is for uh, rotation on axis, on one axis, which is, in most cases, is enough. There is also a circle in the middle of the handle, which is to place the object pivot on other objects. For example, by taking it, you can place the object anywhere, even on the wall. Or for example, this object on a chair. Or for example, the object goes into the ground. It is enough to take this tool and place it by clicking and dragging placed it it's automatically placed on the floor just note that this tool placed the center of the object on the other surfaces if the center of the object was in the middle instance of the bottom of the object this uh, did not happen again and the middle of the object goes on the surfaces if you click on this arrow, the software transform system opens. The first tool that opens by default was selecting and translate tool. But the next tool is rotate, which is used to rotate the object on, on all desired axes. What should we do if we want to return the previous state after, for example, changing all this rotation? Change the rotation. But as you can see, if we hover the most over this handle, the number is zero. To access the exact coordinates of the object, open the object manager and click this section. And from this list, select transform here you can access all position numbers relative to the software center and the rotation number relative to x and y and z axis axis and the scale is 100 percent okay for example in rotation we zero all of them and everything goes right okay back to the tools the next tool is scale objects you can as you can see you can resize objects on the direction of all three axes which is not suitable but in the most cases is enough but if you want to resize the objects with aspect ratio in all direction, you take the square in the middle of the handle and click and drag. As you can see, it resides relative to all axes with aspect ratio. This is nice. The next option is to change the axis of the object. I mean toggle local and world axis. The local axis of the object is if we for example, rotate this object, the axis of the object rotate with it, and it is in the direction of the object. This is called local <coughs> axis. But the world axis of world axis or the main axis of the software is 
always go upward and does not change. By clicking on this option, as you can see, you can toggle or choose between these two modes for, for example, rotation and movement. For example, this object is rotating this direction. If you want to move it upward exactly at the work coordination, toggle board and move it up. If we want to move it in the object direction, toggle local, as you can see. The next option is pivot mode. To determine the center of an object, you must first click on it to activate it. As you can see, the shape of the handle has changed and you can change the center of the object. For example, place it on the top of the object while clicking and dragging on these handles. You can move it on any direction that you want. If you go to the, for example, rotation tool, you will be see that the rotation of the object is relative to the same center or it's same center of the pivot or for example, the scale tool. If you hold the mouse on the pivot tool, we can reset pivot or center pivot so that the center of the object returns to the previous states. Okay. Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.